Hey guys, welcome back to another Unfiltered Gamer card game, board game, or snowman game review. Today's game up on the tabletop is called what? Snowman Dice. And in Snowman Dice, you're going to be doing what? We're going to be rolling dice and building snowman and racing to the North Pole. Because once every year at the North Pole, an interesting event occurs in which players are going to build snowmen and those snowmen are going to try and race to the North Pole. I'm it, beat you. It, it happens on the occasion. And uh, basically in the game you'll be getting some dice, rolling them, trying to build your snowman, and pushing your snowman after you've built it to the middle of the board. But players can do something evil. And flick snowballs at the snowman trying to race to the North Pole. And if your snowman falls apart, you have to re-roll your snowman die, and hopefully you'll get your snowman up in time to push it back to the middle. First to the finish wins a certain amount of points, and the first to three points throughout all of the rounds is the winner of the game, Snowman Dice. Let's go ahead and take a look down below. We'll show you what's in the game and the very simple way to play. Okay, so in this two to four player game, we come fully equipped with five dice for each person, and this is the way that you can build the snowman. So we have the head, the middle of the body, and the bottom of the snowman, which is indicated by the little dot at the bottom. The snowflake is a wild, so it counts for either the head, the center, or the bottom. We have a snowball, and we also have an arrow. Now we use the arrow to move the snowman. We have to build the snowman first. You can either use the wild or any of these, and then you have to have an arrow also to be able to push your snowman. And in the game, depending on the number of players that you're playing with, each player is gonna get a set of dice, which is five. And you're gonna put the players in the corners of the board. You're going to set this little North Pole marker right in the middle. And then you're going to uh, move your little bag aside. This little bag in the game comes with a little zipper. Basically you put all your die and everything inside this cute little snowball bag. And this is the basic rules of the game. So everybody's got their side, they've got their die. And it's a pretty simple way to play the game. You're just gonna simply start rolling die and trying to build a snowman and so if you build if you get certain uh, pieces like I got the bottom there I got the middle I can place this like this and then I could place also this little top one here because it is a snowflake as a wild but I can't push it just yet so I'm gonna have to actually keep rolling until I get ooh beautiful a, uh, a little arrow here and so I'm then going to be pushing my snowman so when you first start you go one two three snow and then everybody rolls their die up until this point then you're going to say like something like the snowman is coming in which case you're gonna start pushing your snowman to the middle of the board but something interesting can happen Ashley might be able to flick me missed oh. aha but if she did hit me and knock me over I have to start over again when you roll you can choose to reroll any die that you like and you can choose to keep any die that you like and as as you do so, you're in a skill to try and uh, basically make your snowman again. Snowballs can be set aside if you want, so you can flip people's uh, snowman over as they're building it, or they can simply be re-rolled. Then once again, oh, my snowman's going, and if it makes it, oh, I got lucky there, to the middle of the North Pole here, that's going to score points for the round, and that will end the round. You'll say freeze once you get there, and then you'll go ahead and look and see if any of your pieces are wild. If any one piece is a wild, you're going to score one point for making it to the middle there. If if none of them are wild, then you're going to go ahead and score two points. And basically you're going to go ahead and restart the game again. One, two, three, snow. Players are going to keep rolling again up until the point where somebody scores a total of three points uh, uh, co collectively throughout all of the rounds of the game. And that's pretty much the idea of Snowman Dice. Two to four players. Of course, the, the crazy dexterityness goes through as people keep rolling and rolling. And uh, yeah, that's the basic idea. So let's go ahead and come up and talk about the game a little bit, see what we thought about it, and whether or not you should pick up Snowman Dice by Mike Elliott. That's right. So that's the basic idea for Snowman Dice, a pretty simple game. It takes probably, what, like five minutes to play, I if know. that. And you're just going to keep going and going and going. Now, of course, there's multiple rounds. So if you win one, I win one, Grant wins one, and we keep going around to that point, it could go up to maybe 10 minutes potentially, especially if you're really good at flicking those snowballs and knocking over people's snowmans. Uh, that, that's a lot of fun in this game. It is a luck-based game because you're rolling die. And it is a dexterity game because you can keep rerolling as fast as you want, as well as the fact that you're going to be using those snowball, snowball dice as best you can to make sure that you can keep yourself from losing the, the round specifically. Uh, I enjoyed this game. It's fun. It's quick. It's very simple. There's not a huge amount of strategy to it, but if you're good at flicking and you are uh, quick at rolling, it's very likely that you're going to win this game. What did you think? 
Um, I actually really like the fact that you can take it anywhere. Like, it's really small. The rules are super straightforward. It took you, what, two minutes to read the rule book? Yeah. Maybe. Um, yeah, I take it on a family vacation or to a friend's house or anything. It's super fun. The dice are really nice. Um, the art is cool, and I like the idea. Yeah. I mean, the only thing I'd probably say about the game, obviously, is it's luck-based, and there's it's not a huge amount of game in here. It is a game. It is fun. But there's just a, just a small game. It's a very simple, very uh, very good kid game, very good quick party game. These would be great stocking stuffers. Yeah. These would make for pretty much anybody's like mini present, I would say. And everything fits in this little snowball, and it actually is a snowball. <laughs> The art's cute, and the quality of everything is very, very nice. Other than maybe, I guess, the little snow, the little North, North pole. pole thing. It's kind of just a flimsy little piece of plastic, but it's just there to symbolize the middle of the board. I think that pretty much anybody who likes dexterity games, likes quick games, and uh, wants to get their kids involved in playing a game are going to like Snowman Dice. Any negatives for you? Um, I don't think so. I mean, the, I think the replayability might be limited, um, but I think the more that you play with different people, then you can switch it up. And... I mean, the idea is very simple. There's only one thing you're ever trying to do. Build that snowman, and then get that arrow and push the snowman to the middle before anybody else without your snowman getting knocked over. But depending on people's skills and the ability in which they can throw certain things, will do, flip certain things, will determine whether or not uh, the game will seem very samey. Of course, it... it it, it is like that, though. You're definitely right. Overall, a fun, fun game. I enjoyed this one quite a bit, and I'm excited to go ahead and take this out to a, a family gathering, maybe to our next, uh, next barbecue, I think. I think the kids will like this one. Yeah, it's fun. All right, guys, thanks for watching another Unfiltered Gamer card game, board game, snowman game review. If you like this video, go and check out the rest of our videos here on YouTube. Like, subscribe, and what? Do you know? Comment. comment you gotta comment down below and you can also go ahead and click the link uh down down the bottom somewhere over here where you can go ahead and pick up snowman dice by brand games if you want for those uh those like family friendly events and uh like ashley was saying before the game would be really rather really quick if you what <laughs> really bad like me oh go ahead and check our website unfilteredgamer.com for the blog post giveaways kicks our list and more we'll have some interesting news on the site and we're currently giving away the game santorini which is really fun on that site that's all i got for you this time guys and as always i look forward to seeing you guys next, next time, time.